So I'm back. <laughs> hey everyone, welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, say Gazy. My name is Gazy. It's nice to meet you guys. It's nice to see you guys again. Uh, I am back. Uh, I want to continue doing YouTube videos because uh, I have a lot of things I want to share. And it seems like uh, TikTok is just too uh, short of content that I can't express everything. Um, starting with TikTok. Well, I downloaded every single video that I've made and I look forward to uploading them in a long form on here on my YouTube channel. Uh, if not, I'll, I'll just like upload them all in YouTube shorts. That way there's always videos happening. But oh my goodness, my phone is going to be ruined. Perhaps I can just use the laptop instead, maybe. So I left TikTok because the comment section, and I know you're not supposed to read the comments. Um, if you do, you engage, the people get your notification and then they want to come back and read your what you said, or they want to reply back. And oftentimes that works with people who want to like argue with you. And I'm not about arguing a silly video that I made. Or if I have a point that I want to share and document, I don't feel like I have to defend it and that's it's something that I really didn't like with TikTok that you had to be your own lawyer of sorts I didn't like that um, uh, I, I, I missed out on a bunch of friends I said my goodbye with a week's time in advance and a lot of them were able to come and find me on on Twitter. They were come. They were able to come and find me here on YouTube as well as on Instagram, and I appreciate them dearly for doing so, because uh, that just goes to show you that people do care. So, why am I here back on YouTube? As I previously stated, I like long form content, and well. I have a lot of things that I want to share. Uh, the first, the first big thing that I want to share is that I am 22,000 words into a brand new book that I am writing called Church Hurt and Observation and Reflection. I didn't know where this book came from. All of a sudden, it just hit me. And uh, if you look at my Instagram uh, story, uh, I think it's in one of the th one of the stories. I forget what I don't know how it's called, but it's in one of those stories at the bottom where you can select, and it's a spe one of those special stories. Uh, I, the highlights. It's in highlights. It's called um, Church Hurt, and I started writing 600 words one night, and then so these earbuds, I I love them, but then I hate them. Because I, I don't know what it is. Maybe I need memory foam uh, instead of the little plastic things that they give you. Or I just need to clean my ears. I don't know which. But I've been, like, I wrote 600 words and I don't know where it all came from. And then what ended up happening was I started to just write, like, in, in structures. Like, I, I, I wrote concepts. Let me just take them out. I wrote concepts, right? Actually, let me look at it's not earwax. I have no idea what it is. It's not it's not waxy It's it's not it really isn't and of course I so I have a new phone I have a new oh, let me show you I have an old this was my old this was my old phone This was my old phone that I was using for probably a majority of the videos that you see on my YouTube channel like all of them like it was this bad boy right here the LG stylo I think I still yep I still have the stylus and so my present one is a Motorola something something and it also has a stylus so I'm a stylus dude even though I don't use my stylus so this bad boy this with the screen like it was it I love this thing and I'm gonna hold on to this thing forever I hold on to all of my old phones I don't know why but I do so going back like I I just it just came out and I started to structure the story the 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 narrative that I've that I've and I, I came up with chapters 
and after having the chapters then the content just started flowing and what I noticed about myself in writing this nonfiction uh, observ I called it an observation and a reflection because what I want to do is do uh, an objective point of view but there are points where I want to interject so I'm trying to draw the line very clearly I don't want this to be a book that is subjective at all if anything I want it to be a pure balanced observation of something that is happening in the Christian church and I also want to share my thoughts on it polar like separate I don't want to like I don't I don't want to mix the two I, I don't I want you to know what I think but I also want you to know what's going on so I'm already 22,000 words in it I'm really excited I, I even have I'll show you the I'll show you the art the cover art I, I need to get it to a uh, illustrator so if you're an illustrator hit me up uh, show me some of your work and maybe we can talk about uh, pricing uh, but I also I need like a very good amount of cover art work like if you you need to know how to do a book so uh, I'll show you guys uh, I'll show you guys when I like right here see so that's the cover um, it's very it's very rudimentary but it really does speak to how I see things I really want this imagery as well I want this imagery because the problem is is that it's what I feel it's what I think and I it exemplifies the book um, I know that uh, cover artists and other uh, publishing houses they might have a certain take for your book however I'm self-publishing this and so it's what I feel and this makes my story a more concentrated work you're getting everything from my heart everything from my 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 perception and I think that's the best way you could read someone's book um, I published true north it's available on Goodreads as well as on Amazon the ebook as well as the paperback novel uh, shadow the firefly shadow the firefly is on YouTube it's on my channel here all you have to do is just look it up shadow the firefly uh, Gazy Rojas or you scroll through my videos and it's free the full book is as far as the video movie is free you can enjoy it and if you want to support me if you like having an actual book I it's for sale on Amazon as well uh, this book I think I might publish uh, not through Amazon uh, but I might make it available to Amazon so we'll just see how that works because Ingram spark does some really nice hardcovers I think with this book it will be a hardcover and if I might not make any sales because uh, to make profit off of a hardcover book uh, you have to charge a nasty a nasty amount of money and unless you're like uh, Jordan Peterson or any of these great um, highly purchasable books it, you're not gonna see money up front like a down payment like most of these publishing houses do they'll give you 50 grand right back and anything extra whatever after a certain selling point so that is though that's what's going on with me as far as literature goes um, since I decided to leave TikTok, I uh, I decided to leave Facebook as well and I took with it the, the all the Facebook pages that were based off of True North um, the only the only social media that I am on at the moment is uh, Twitter Instagram and YouTube so I like I guess with this I'll close um, I just wanted to be I wanted to examine myself I wanted to um, challenge myself I wanted to go and and do things that uh, would benefit my mind my mental health uh, I'm going to the gym I lost 10 pounds I'm bulk like I'm like building up a frame uh, I'll show I'll do I don't know I don't want to do like a, I don't want to show my body online because I feel that would be weird but I am making visible progress uh, at least that's what my wife says and that's what matters the most 
So um, I'm going to keep on doing these things. I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you've stuck around and listened to me share stuff. Uh, please uh, like, share, subscribe. I, I don't know what you say anymore on YouTube. Um, I would like this channel to grow, so please share it. Um, maybe later on I'll share, I'll do some manga stuff. And I'll talk to you about all the manga that I've been reading. So um, I'll do that. So it's nice to see you guys again. Uh, just like uh, Steve said, I never forgot you. So uh, my name is Gazy, and this is Say Gazy.